Hey hey! The last digit of your like on this video by each who you are from Melon Playground, and the last digit of your subscription to my channel will show your Melon Playground item. So go down right now, subscribe and give me a like. Look at the screen. Notice the last digit of your like and your subscription and write in the comments who you are from Melon Playground. It's simple, if your like is number 8 and the last digit of your subscription is number 5, you're a lemon and a cactus. Show your imagination and enjoy the show. Hello dear friends and you are on the channel Melon Funk, in this video I will tell you a couple of new cool myths and facts Melon Playground, but before I start the video, I as always want to say a huge thank you to these guys for being in my video and if you want to get in my next videos, it's quite simple. You need to subscribe to the channel, don't forget to like it, write your top comment. Anyway, I won't waste your time with this and have fun watching it. Well the next myth is as follows. I have prepared some cool myths for you, so pay attention and listen carefully. What if you change the color of the flashlight to black, will it shine nothing? In general this is a very interesting question in principle an interesting foundation for testing myths let's see what happens if you put a flashlight on the map turn off his black light and try to shine. Let's check what happens if we fulfill all the conditions, and in fact guys and nothing happens. Realistically, it just doesn't shine the black light. I mean, I thought it would be really cool if it actually shines black, but it basically shines nothing. So there's nothing that's quite interesting and in general darkness is the absence of light and it's impossible to shine black, so all the physics conditions are met. And the next myth is when you stretch a garland it has more and more bulbs on it, please check it out. I think that's very interesting and let's see if that actually works in Melon Playground. And moving on to the map, we can take about let's say a flashlight just in on the pause stretch let's say our garland and let's see. In principle, whether we can even get a check or not. Yes in principle it really works our garland stretches and there are more and more bulbs as cool works I do not know how much it is necessary and useful, but it works. Well, the next myth is interesting, is it possible to put an Edison lamp in the place where candles are inserted, if this thing is called a candlestick? Everything is quite simple, and let's check, I was actually interested. I think that this is basically illogical, if it works, but if it doesn't work, then basically everything is correct. Let's see, we take an Edison light bulb and just try to put an Edison light bulb in our candlestick. As you can see, it's staring, but it's not put on something wrong. In general, it does not work or does not work partially. That is, in principle, it somehow works, but it works it is completely not as it should be. Therefore, it is possible to move on to the next myth, because it does not work until the end. Well, the next myth of oh my god is that I'm in the video. Congratulations, buddy, you got there again. Bugs explanation of Melon Funk. I'm sorry very much, I accidentally forgot to write that it is necessary not to shoot from a pistol, but from a paintball gun, and then clothes or armor should be in the foreground. I've been playing with the phone in general, let's check this myth again and see if this myth works in principle on any of the devices. I think that there is no difference in devices, in general, we just start shooting at our melon, which is already dressed in a bulletproof vest from our paintball gun, and see the result. And as you can see, in fact, nothing changes, except that as if our bulletproof vest is essentially invisible, that is, it does not protect our melon from paintball gun hits. Pay attention as if the bulletproof vest is not worn on the body and look, after a while, after all, our melon dies from paintball weapons. Although, in fact, it is in a bulletproof vest that can withstand at least the caliber of a pistol. In general, this is a very strange bug, to be honest, it really works and I don't know why it works in principle and how the developers missed it if you are a developer watching my video, then be sure to fix it. Well, let's move on to the next myth or you can say BUG, I don't know, judge me as you want. Bug, if you put a red background and put a pumpkin, the background will turn black. Let's see how it works. 
To be honest, I doubt it works. And so we just changed the background to red and, in fact, put just a pumpkin and that's it. Let's take a look and nothing changes, although the color of the map is actually cool and if it worked, it would be very strange, but it doesn't work. Most likely you had some kind of bug that the whole map is black, in fact, this happens to many people, but if this does not happen, then, in principle, everything should work for everyone, just like I have on the screen now. So it doesn't work and maybe I did something wrong, so be sure to write about it in the comments. Well, the last fact for today, an interesting fact, if you take garlands and remove the light bulbs, you get a wire and let's check it. We take a garland and try to remove our light bulb and honestly, I can't just take it and remove it. I would like to try to do this, but something does not work out for me and perhaps I am doing something wrong again. Write in the comments, how many times I repeat this, that if I do something wrong, then be sure to notify me about it and here. No matter how many times I've tried to fix it, they're just kind of transparent. I can't delete them. If you delete, then delete all garland. So here it is such a bug fact that we have today that doesn't really work for me, but maybe it works for you, my video is coming to an end. Thank you all for watching, good luck to everyone so far and remember, buddy, as always, see you one of these days.